yeah. as we look at these, we want to look at survival needs. We want to look at love and affection needs. We want to look at control needs. Inclusion. In other words, I'm an important, valuable part of this group. And competence. Those are the needs. Yeah, right? th those are the needs, right. Mm -hmm. And so instead of asking ourselves, you know, how can we force this kid to learn? So instead of asking, hey, what can we, what kind of carrot can we stick in front of the kid's nose, yeah, get him to work, or, or what can we take away uh -huh. to get this kid to work? Instead of asking those questions, we're asking this. We're asking this question. This may be the most important question of this whole tape, and that is, what basic needs? are not being met in this kid's life. That's where we have to start. We need to, as a group, sit down. And when I say as a group, all the, the adults who care about this kid, yeah. when they can come together and say, let's look at this list. Let's go step by step by step. List of needs. List of needs. Mm -hmm. And then uh, we've got a concerted effort to figure out how can we start to rebuild these needs so that the kid's mind can be freed up to learn right. instead of to focus on surviving or getting through these needs. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> I've never known a kid. Now, this is my 47th year of working with kids. I've yet to have a kid come to me and say, well, the reason I am not turning in my homework is that I have some basic needs that are not being 